We're here at the Vermont Institute of Natural Science. Um, today we are going to be taking the wing wrap off of this young or juvenile common raven. Um, first and foremost, we know it's a juvenile because this bird has blue eyes. Whenever ravens are adults, their eyes are a dark, dark brown color. But whenever they are born and into their first year, their eyes are blue. So we know that this raven was born this year. You can see that the raven has some discolorations to, this, to his beak. It should be all black. Ravens should not have this white coloration. Um, we're not really sure what happened to this raven other than it fell from the nest or some natural cause has had it fall from the nest. Um, he was incredibly emaciated, which means starving to death, and also has a fracture in the wrist of his left wing, which you can see we have a body wrap on right here. So we're going to take off the body wrap and evaluate that, that site. The body has been wrapped up for about a week or a little over a week. Um, and we're going to see how it healed. Otherwise, the bird is doing much better. He has gained weight. His ha appetite is really strong. Um, so we're just going to make sure that that wing has healed up. Hi, I'm Sarah from the Vermont Institute of Natural Science. What you have just seen is one example of the more than 400 birds that VINS cares for each year. As a 501c3 not-for-profit organization, we depend on your support to provide the medical treatment these birds require to get them healthy and back into the wild. In addition to our on-site avian rehabilitation facility, VINS Nature Center in Queechee, Vermont proudly displays an impressive collection of live raptors, songbirds, and other animals for you to see up close. With 47 acres of diverse natural habitats, the VINS Nature Center offers a host of educational programs and special events enjoyable for people of all ages. For the latest information on the birds in our care, a list of our current Nature Center programs, outreach opportunities and events, or to contribute to VINS so that we can continue our important work, please visit our website at vinsweb.org or call 802-359-5000 for more information.